Welcome to Scott's Quick Toy Review. We're looking at Wingspan and Pounce, and they are part of the Cybertronian Villains. Um, it's a, I don't know if it's an exclusive to any store. I got mine at Target for $24.99, $25. Now, back in the day, um, the clones, they're called the clones. I don't think I had these at first. I may have eventually got them, but back when I was a kid, um, I would go to the flea market on Tuesdays, and I'll get, you know, Transformers a lot of times, because... I don't know, they were dirt cheap at the flea market. But I definitely got the two red ones. But these were not like my most sought after. I don't know what it was. I think you know red was cooler. I, I, I can't tell you why. These are uh, the Legends class. I don't even think there is any Legends class other than these for the new... Uh, oh, not War for Cybertron. Although the last time we had one of these was in a two-pack that was with a, a blue one and a red one. It was a Walgreens exclusive. And that was in the Titans Return. So this is from the Earthrise series. So if you bought that two-pack, you have one of these already. And I think it's Wingspan. Because Pounce came in one of the bigger packs. So I may have already had that. I know that I wanted, I think I wanted the Pounce pack. I think that was the one I wanted because it had um, Metal Hawk. And I really want Metal Hawk. And I never could get that. But, oh well. So... I like how articulated they are compared to the original ones. Although the original ones were pretty nice, to be honest with you. Now, I'm going to try to transfer this for the first time. The Double Dealer, I just did a review on that. Mm -mm, no, but that's not going to be something I can do on a camera. I'll be here for hours trying to figure that out. Okay, there's something definitely going on with this head right here. So, when in doubt, turn his head around to the back. Because, you know, that, that fixes everything normally. And it does. Alright, so... The, the hands, if you just rotate his arms around, there's his claws. Now, this is the tricky part that I'm looking at it going, trying to figure out, hmm, how is this going to work? I feel like it should go like that, but then the wings are going to be in a weird position. Let's see. The wings got to be like that. So. There we go. <laughs> no, that's not going to be right. It's got to be another way. Oh, boy. I mean, that makes me wonder if I was just to back up and do another move first. You know, like, you messed up on something and you gotta back up and undo a few things. How in the world is that gonna come up to there? I feel like that's gotta connect to that, but how? Holy crap. Okay. There's no way. Okay. So... I usually have, call this a quick toy review. You know, if I disconnect it, it'll connect. Oh, I see something. Derp. Right there. His crotch step separates. That's gotta hurt. Oh well. I guess he could be on the cheerleading group. Cheerleading squad, because he can do a split. No thank you. That would be painful. Although I used to be able to do butterflies back when I was younger, and all the other people in my karate class couldn't do it. Even my sensei couldn't do it. And I was like, why not? <laughs> I didn't understand because I was double jointed back then. I couldn't do a split though. Because I'm a guy. You know, it's just something not natural for that to be able to be done. Alright, hold on. I think I may have went overstep here. You don't have to do all I did, but maybe you do. <laughs> Alright, let's twist it all about. Let's go this way with it. And I'm probably overdoing it here. But it works. <laughs> oh my gosh. Come on, work with me here. Work with me. Okay. Ah, there. Whew, got it on. Bang it gone. Got it on. All right. There we go. Wings span. I got his wings to span. Nice. Whew, that wasn't that hard. All right. Let's figure this one out. Um, this one, once again, you're going to have to turn the head around. See, see how the head's a little in. No, you're like, no, the shoulder pads, all I can see. Um, the head goes in a little bit. That creates that groove that the that part right there, I can't, the hinge, hides in. So there. All right. It just feels really weird for this one. I hear it. Um, there's nothing for his arms. His arms are just held on by friction. Oh, that is cool. His legs are actually articulated because in the original one they weren't. They're just kind of there. Okay, I know that this folds up somehow. Oh boy, it's another one of those split the leg thing. <laughs> but do you have to split the legs on this one? Let's look. 
feel like you just turn him around like that. Bam. There we go. Yeah, you don't have to split the legs. I think it's just... I don't know. And then you pull down his tail. And that's him. That was much easier in my opinion. He does have the leg split thing right there. I don't... It doesn't have a purpose. I don't think. I don't know why. I guess because they're clones. They have to have some similarities. Oh well. To my knowledge, you don't have to split his legs. Now if you want to, I guess you could. Like that. To make his legs a little bit wider. I don't know. Maybe it's a she and you're going to have her have childbirth and hips. All right. Well, anyway, um, that's it. That's all you got to do. There are little holes right here. There's no weapons that came with these, which I was kind of not bummed out about, but I'm just like always expecting little guns with everything. All right. Well, that was it. So we got wingspan and pounce. And what do you guys think? Um, they're basically $12.50 each. The older Legends were $10 each, so you're getting uh, $5 more for, you know, two clones. And I don't know, I like them a lot. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. I wonder if they can combine and form a winged flying cat. Ah, thanks for watching. Live long and perspire. I'm going to go play now.